Captain's blog, time is 8.32 a.m. And uh, this is how my day is starting. Time is 10.54 and it's getting doomy. Twelve fifty-seven hours. We're here in the robotics lab, where we have, well, Larry and Curly, pretty much, and we're hey, Mo coming in sometime soon. <laughs> and and uh, what what are we doing today, Liz? We're shooting an epoxy video. Yeah, again. Again. This is like the this... fourth time we've shot this video. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Apparently it is, but this is going to be the special product when we try to sell at Rust Oleum. Oh, okay. So what what are your guys' thoughts on this? Meh. <laughs> I wish it was not as humid down here. Well, but. maybe if we hadn't run a pressure washer for a week and a half. <laughs> yeah, but still, I feel like I'm swimming right now. So. Okay, so, so, so what are we doing? What, what's the thing here? Right now, well, that's we're a piece gonna of get cardboard. <laughs> Thanks, Bob. Well, and now, to Dave with the weather. That's why I throw it over to Sweet. Oh, okay. Squeak, what are we doing? We're going to mix some epoxy patch. Yeah? Yes. Okay. And then fill holes. See, I was hoping for some, like, intelligent insight on we're making a video on the camera dude, this is what we got going on, but I can't get that from anybody. I can't. It's a oh, I'll make you epoxy video. I got, I got this box here that, that takes some pretty pictures, and I like, and there's ice cream today, yay! And, <laughs> I was just rubbing that in your face so for you had, no reason. you had to teach people how to clean a lens? No. <laughs> Barely know how to. I'm just going to shoot this because then like there's going to be 10,000 people on the internet that are going to be doing it wrong! Ah, you have watch, to... Watch the level of fucks I give. Wait, wait, go! I don't want. See, this is where you're going to start a holy war between the people that say you got to wipe in a straight line from the center to the edge, and the people that say you got to wipe in circles, and the people that say you got to spritz it on a cloth. Oh, that smells gay. <laughs> you would be the authority. Versus the, the people that say you got to spritz it on a lens, and yeah. Now, see, I wipe in two circles. I wipe in a small smirk circle, and then I go around in a bigger circle while I do it. like Bob Ross. That's a happy lens. It is just a happy lens. <laughs> You gotta go to the dry side and then you do the same thing there. And we'll put a little bush there. <laughs> Happy little trees. <laughs> Come. <laughs> he probably needs it too. Oh, wow. Camera goes to more of a war zone than the ones we actually use for video. Oh, totally. It's not easy being. Do you know how many of these little cameras I've killed? No. I, this is like the fifth one. I'm, I'm on like my fifth camera. We started doing these in what? Uh, 2006. What? I don't know. Taking it, away from you. Making the everybody video else worse. See, that's the difference you can tell. See, and, and this, this is a thing that a lot of people do. Because I get people that ask, they're like, who's, who's the cameraman for all the things that does the really smooth shots and all that? I'm like, what do you mean? It's like, well, I can tell, you know, when somebody who doesn't normally hold the camera holds it, but the guy who normally holds it never talks. But when somebody who doesn't normally hold it, it's all shaky in that. I'm like, you know, I just, I just hold it out with my hand, right? And they're like, yeah, we are. Like, yeah, I just hold it with my hand. What? What a thrill! Like, how do you do it so still? I was like, well, I've done it like twelve times a day for five years, and you get good at it. So, you know, it's just oh, it's yeah, baby. Look at that Oh, you got you got mad skills. Oh yeah. Someday, Corey, I'm gonna grow up and be just like you. That's my dream. <laughs> Same haircut and everything. That's right. Rocking the beeb. 
so not the Beeb. But if you see red this week, it, it was the Beeb when I when I first got it. I think you should go back to the mushroom thing you oh, had going. Fuck. What? Getting little fuzzies. Du hast Schmutz. Du hast Schmutz on der Finster. Get another one. It's called Der Finster. 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 Which makes me think of the you know where I learned that animated word? televised program Recess. Now you know where I learned Finster. It's Finster, who was an indemnable bitch. Cool. Would you like to tell us where you learned Finster? Die hard. <laughs> now here's a crucial question: Which one? So uh, if you say second, we are. I, I no airport. Quit on this airport. Second. Oh, okay. so I quit. Yeah, sorry. Shyston Finster. Shyston Finster. How can you even watch that? Shyston. Because it doesn't have Jerry May Irons or uh, fucking what's his name. I love that this is not going to um, end the vlog, but you're still. Who is it? He played fucking Snape in the Harry Potter movies. Alan Rickman. Alan Rickman doesn't have Alan Rickman or or Jeremy Irons, which means a Die Hard. Hang on, hang on. Shitty Snape movie. was in Die Hard. Yeah. Yes. It's the first Die Hard. And in Galaxy Quest. Which one Quest? is Snape? Fucking Hans Gruber, you idiot. That's Snape. It is, isn't it? <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> Never noticed that. And now we've changed Chris's life forever. Hey, dude, the one that changed my life forever was when I saw Pee Wee Herman as a Coke dealer. Okay, <laughs> that did it for me. <laughs> I can't even watch Do you ever see Blow? It's no. so bad. Oh, it's awesome. Pee Wee Herman as like a major pot dealer who then like kind of gets into Blow. But yeah, well, the movie's Blow. But at that stage, it's pot. Pee Wee Herman as a gay drug dealer. <laughs> and it's actually really believable. They got Bob Goldthwait in there too. They got they got Bob Goldthwait in there too, and him as a like you know coke chemist totally sells it. <laughs> Whatever happened to Bob Goldthwait? Bobcat Goldthwait. Yeah, Bobcat Goldthwait. Home in an episode of Star, not a couple years ago. As a patient, yeah. <laughs> as a meth head, maybe. I didn't show his face. He was on her sheet the whole time. <laughs> Within the last two months, I listened to an interview with him on. Uh, WTF with Mark Marin. He's still working? Ish. He's doing kind of underground things, but Probably Vegas. he's not in like any role. He's doing Police Academy 50. <laughs> he went to Vegas to die a comedian's death. Ooh, man. Vegas? Vegas is where the comedians go to die. Vegas? No, Atlantic City. Oh, that's yeah. true. <laughs> Alright, can we make a video now? I don't know, can we? Are I think we? we're making one right now. This does not count. Don't oh, oh. Good one. <laughs> I would just like to note for the uh, astute viewers, there was actual no hand slap there. So, that's how we roll. We're gonna make a video now, you guys have fun. 1739 hours, and I wanted to say thank you to Jeremiah Duke. You sent us the uh, CCD camera mounts. We're going to be using these right there in the set that we're building for the vehicular sciences lab. So, thank you, sir. You're gonna get to see us hang those up. 1844 hours and we've got uh, it's it's just roughed in but check out the difference this makes How's that for cool? It's epic over there and You can see the, the lights from the regular lights over there and then boom That's it's gonna be good. It's gonna be really really good. I'm very happy with those lights. 1910 hours, and we had to set scaffolding up in the corner here. Um, this is kind of cool that you get to see a cool shot of the room. I've never been up this high in this corner, so here's how it looks. Pass machines from the top. And there's the set over there. Batman with harness. Ciprasu. The cars, the sparkly pretty cars. And look at the change in the VSL. Man, what a difference one light can make. We're going to do this whole room in them, so it's going to be pretty cool. Yeah, that's a ball guard. 